Oh, we was. Hey we guys. Were, we was talking about stuff. Hey, look, it's the same day for us. Different day for you. <laughs> that was so nerdy. <laughs> Did you see the book that I just pulled out? This was a surprise. <laughs> I okay. think that was clever. It's clever. It was clever. Clever. So today so we're going to do a book talk video, which is kind of how we like, we, we read books that we like, but we don't really know. Like, okay, we just, we don't have enough time to do individual videos for every single book. So sometimes we just like to That's get a true. couple we of books We would be together. blowing up your guys' feet. <laughs> <laughs> so we like to just get a couple of books that we've read Wouldn't together. Do that, would we? <laughs> 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 so, and, and without... Without doing this on purpose, we both picked a new book that we've read, and we both picked we an did. old book that we've read. Aww, so us I know. So we picked a new book and an old book. So I have been talking nonstop since the last review, and I was so excited about it. How about you start? Oh, my throat my hurts. Shell. A little parched. <laughs> my throat's a little parched. A little parched. I just finished this book, I don't know, like a few weeks ago. And it's an oldie. But, but I just got to it, so yeah. calm down. So, I read it on my Kindle because I always have a book I'm reading on my Kindle. That way I can read it in bed and nobody gets mad at me for staying up so late, blah, 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 blah. Anyways. You know, bright lights. The selection. Guys, I freaking love this book so much. Yes. And I didn't think I was because I'm not into The Bachelor. I'm not into, like, those shows or whatever. I read them. I've, so, I read the first three <laughs> and I like them too. So, I and I don't it. like The Bachelor either. And I think it's just like, like the the idea of a bunch of girls like fighting, sitting around fighting over a guy. If I have to fight for a guy, I'm just like I don't want him. I don't yeah. want him. So, but I guess he's a, you know gonna be a king or whatever. And Prince Maxon is freaking amazing. <laughs> I fell in love with Prince Maxon from the get go. Yeah, he I like is him. not like your normal royalty. Like he's not stuck up. He's not a jerk face. It's and really the main nice. character, I love. her. So basically, there's 35 girls, and they they each get chosen from. They like put in applications, and then they get chosen, and they're they're named the chosen. Well, oh my the god! The selection. And can I just re? Can I just add something in here? I'm trying to look for it, but I don't see it somewhere around here. When we were talking about, I read this years ago when it first came out. Not when it first came out, because there was two or three books already. And then I read Girls of Paper and Fire oh, recently. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so, anybody who's read both Ooh, the books, I would you. like to just know it's similar, but this is a beautiful version of that. <laughs> the and version. the Girls of Paper and Fire is like the evil version of that. So, if you like this book, I would recommend you read Girls of Paper and Fire, but it's a lot harder to read. And there's no lovely Prince Maxim. Love it. Mm -hmm. Basically, 35 girls get chosen. They go and they live in the castle and they, they're like trained to be queen and they get like beautiful dresses and all that stuff. Makeovers. Yes. Oh, I want a makeover. And then they basically fight for the king's extension and try to make him like them. And then they get chosen down to the last ten and that's called the elite. But she hasn't read that one yet. Yes. So you're to the, so it's the first ten. They mm -hmm. get down to ten in this book? Yes. Okay. At the very end it ends with, and now like the elite begins or something oh, okay. like that. So there's lots of stuff that goes on in it, lots of things that obstacles that would get in the way. Mean um, girls, there are mean some girls, mean girls, yeah. obviously. Asp or America is the uh, main character, and I love her. I, I don't love her, her but because I she is an average her. girl. She's not one of the popular girls. She's not rich. Is it America funny singer. that? Is it funny that I when I started this book? Oh God, I'll just wait. Okay, the selection. <laughs> this is my. Cass, not class. Do you love how they're always like, oh, she's just an average girl. She's not beautiful. She's she not really rich. is, though. <laughs> she's not rich. She's not. She's plain. She's pretty, but she's not beautiful. Like, and she gets, she's like, what's her face in here? And oh, she gets her. the main man. Like, I'm average. And look at you. You got you a main I know, man. but where's all the, the castle and the gold? Well, honey, we don't live in fantasy young adult. <laughs> Unfortunately, we live in America. America. <laughs> Ew. So gross. So gross. The selection. So gross. Read I'm it. Gonna, I'm, moving to I'm moving to Canada with Gabrielle. Hey, Gabrielle. <laughs> we coming at you. You think she'll take us? Yes. Yeah, if we come 
crying on your doorstep, just know. She could be like, no Americans. Just here. know that we warned you on this video. If you didn't watch this video, that's on you, girl. We're going to be there on Saturday. We're going to be there. No, we're not kidding. Okay. Just sitting on your porch <laughs> waiting for you to get back. So the reason I brought up the average looking girl is because guess what I just read? <laughs> Crave. Is it the average girl? <laughs> She's like, I'm not that pretty. <laughs> I don't have any special okay, talents. So America was shocked that she even got chosen. Her mom made her. She didn't even want to get chosen. What I can't believe the hottest guy in school thinks I'm so pretty and he's so obsessed with me. Oh my god! Why would a king even like me? Uh <laughs> I'm so ordinary! Okay, so she's so ordinary. <laughs> and I was telling Nikki before before you got here, <laughs> I was telling Nikki that this book is so cliche that they make fun of their own cliche-ness <laughs> in the book. It's so true. It's, they're just like... Remember that one time, the Vampire Diaries, <laughs> that Damon brought up Twilight? Yeah. I love... <laughs> In this book, Jackson gives her a copy of Twilight. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, so, you know, I don't like to give too much away, but, <laughs> oh my God. So, when I started this book, it's a big one. It's like 600 pages. I don't even know. Let's see. Oh, God. I have commitment issues already. She does have Oh, 571. It's, it's not 600. Doable. You're fine. <laughs> Doable. So, when I started this book, and a lot of the time when you read a book, if you have a lot of time to devote to it, you just really connect with it because you get to sit there with it for a long time. And so, the, when I started this book, I got to sit with it for a long time. So, I got about halfway through it, and I really liked it. And then, so, about this much of it, I really, really liked it. And I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. It does, obviously, cliche. Right? Because I just said that. Twilight, Legacies, like all of it. Vampire Diaries. And then we got Vampire Diaries. Then we got here. And I was like, mm, is this the same book? Let me hurry up. And then we got here. I'm like, uh, okay. And then it got good again. <laughs> <laughs> and definitely ended on something I did not see coming. And there is going to be a second book. We found that out a few weeks ago. I haven't decided. Hey, what did you rate this book? Oh. Five. Five stars. I haven't decided if I will take the time to read the second one. I mean, mm -hmm. it's probably going to be like 700 pages this time. I might just look up a synopsis online I or... Really commit to I don't think I want pages. to... That's basically seven months. The end... <laughs> the end of this book was a little intriguing. Not intriguing enough for me to... I don't think I'll even buy the second one. So I did rate it a three because I did like the first half pretty good. It, you know, it's got all your cliche stuff, but it's also got a little bit of different stuff in it. And then at the end, I don't know if anybody's a friend, a, a friend, a fan of Jennifer Armentrout, but she has a whole series. So I've read that series. And so um, it wasn't super shocking to me how it ended because I have heard of something like that before, but if you haven't read, and I'm not going to tell you what series because I don't want to run it for you, then... I love her. I do too. I think I've read some books by her. Onyx, or she did the Damon, the... I'll tell you later. I loved that series. There's a Damon the Lux, series? It's the Lux series, and the main character is Damon. Yeah, and that's the best series ever. If you haven't read Jennifer Armentrout's series, I think it's the Lux series... Gosh, it's been a lot of years ago I read it. Super good. It's, they're all, t they're so good. Okay. Brave. Oh. Brave, I gave a three star by Tracy Wolf because I liked the beginning enough to grade it three star. But if I had not sat with it as long as I did in the beginning, I probably would, would not have even it given up. it a three star. So sit with it, right? <laughs> right. Or just. Skip it. That's just so mean. Take a take a day. Take a day. If, if you like cliche, this is your book. But it was so cliche. I actually rolled my eyes several times. I'm sitting in the living room all by myself, <laughs> like, oh my god, <laughs> really? Oh my god. <laughs> I, oh, but.
But the titles of all the chapters are hilarious. You make the earth shake under my feet and everywhere else, too. There are funny, <laughs> funny titles. Uh, okay, it's three stars. I liked it. Now that we're dissecting it, I did like it. And the main character girl did get on my nerves a few times because so I'm like just Bella. like, like Elena. I loved Bella. Hated Bella. I love Bella. She looked like this the entire movie. I loved her, but she got on my nerves like Elena Gilbert did in Vampire Diaries. This girl, <laughs> this girl allowed what, way you, too much. You loved me? <laughs> no, I'm talking about Elena. Who are you talking about? I'm talking about, oh Bella. God, I'm talking about Bella. I love Bella. Elena's. Oh, woe is me. Everybody's dying around me. Oh, save me and put yourself at risk. The entire eight seasons. <laughs> no, don't die for me. Why aren't you helping me? Oh, you're dead. Oh, no, you're dead. Cry. Move on to the Oh, my God. Diary. We are hating. I love the Vampire Diaries. I do too, but I hate Elena. I, I don't care for Elena. I mean, as a person, I'm sure she's cool and I like her in... I like her in Victorious. <laughs> that's, that's her not, doppelganger. That's not her. That's Catherine. Are weird. That's Catherine. Catherine and Amara. <laughs> Amara. 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 But I don't hate her enough that I won't continue to watch Vampire Diaries. No, I'll still watch I it. I love her That's enough. for sure. I'll I, still watch I love it. her. I love her. She's just whiny. I don't hate her. Girl, I don't do God, whiny. We just babble on and I on. I don't do whiny. You know <laughs> You're a guy and you're whiny. Bye. Girl and you're whiny. Bye. I will tolerate you and talk My about dog you whines for in food. book reviews. He's a dog, so I have to love him. Dogs are super whiny and super. Okay, your book. Next book. Yeah. Okay. So this one is by Colleen Hoover. Oh. Without merit. And guys, I connected so much with the main girl in this book. I like. So this her is about oh, like mental health that kind of thing but it's funny dealing with families dealing with family issues mm -hmm. let's see they have a very like odd family mm -hmm. they thing. lived in a church in a church like it's an been old a long church. time yes. since i read it and the cool thing is is that and and it is that mara is her name and mm -hmm. and so you know whenever you get to the part of the book that you realize why is it, which is you know, right immediately you're just like oh now it clicks Without also, me. Sagan is one of the main guys in here, and he made my top boyfriend list the year that I read this. I believe it was 2018. It was a long time ago. But I really loved that book, too. It and so I want to say this is her only young adult book. Does she have any other young adult books? I don't know. I don't I read, think so. Yeah, I read, um, not Verity. <laughs> um, I read... No young adult from Verity. <laughs> Um, Seek mental health immediately yeah, um, afterwards. Yeah, um, Regretting You. Oh, I haven't read that. Yeah, that, Is was, that, that was really good. I have yeah, it. Yeah, it follows the teen. Okay. Like, I she's have like it. a senior. I I oh, I love yet. that one. That was good. This was a good book. I loved it, guys. And it was an easy read. Without Mary, it was funny. I laughed. I remember laughing out loud. There's, there's some romance in it. There's some mental health in there. Some of the stuff you're going to sit back and ponder. But it's very good. I, I really like, I think a lot of it I really liked was, like, the family issues, you know, like, I don't remember all the details, but I remember, you know, seeing things from other different angles of yes. family, and, and you know, how teenagers, everything is so dramatic, and everything is horrible, but then she did see things from other, 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 yeah. other sides, didn't she? And so, she just, I think that her relationship with her family was... They lived in a church, and her dad wouldn't take down the statue of Jesus. Awesome. <laughs> it was in their living room. It was room, in their living it? room, yeah. <laughs> just chilling. Because their living room was It was the, just hanging out the, on the cross in their living the room. sanctuary. <laughs> Anyways. The sun is Oh, and her brother. The sign out in front of the, the church. Oh, yeah. Her brother would go out there and, and change, the change the sign and leave little messages. I don't remember what any of the messages <laughs> no, were. No, he they was were funny. funny. He was younger and he was funny. Yeah. It, it's a good book. It is. I think I five starred that one. Oh, I did too. Five At star. least four. At least four. You, you guys and I'm pretty sure I read it in one setting, if not two. Yeah. I read it pretty fast. Yeah, we read it fast. And we may have done an individual book review on it. I can't remember because it's know. been a Why don't you go search for our videos? Watch all of them while you're at it. Why do people make funny faces? I don't know. While you're talking, I spent like a good I five it. minutes doing this. I do it all the time. 
So the second book I chose to talk about, also I couldn't remember if we talked about it or not. So I wanted oh, yeah. to bring it up because it was sitting next to that series. <laughs> Since she was there already. I was hey. like, oh, I'll take that book too. Okay. I loved the whole series. Pretty sure I read it all four or fives. I don't even know. The whole series? The whole series. That's Scott, rare. Scott Westerfield's series, The Uglies. And I believe The Uglies is the first book. And I know it's been years. These have been out for a while, right? I want to say I read these books before I met you. I have the extras Way before at home. I met you. I so, don't have the middle two, though. I have Uglies and I have extras. You have Uglies, you should read it. So, it's a rare book <laughs> that you book can says, read. Read them all. <laughs> <laughs> and then I said it. It's so funny. <laughs> so. <laughs> I, don't know, I just quacked. Like, that wasn't, uh, that wasn't like a laugh. That was a quack. What is it again? I went. Oh, I don't even. I can't even do it again. <laughs> like, like Santa? Oh. That's not a quack. That's a ho ho. <laughs> it wasn't a ho oh. It was like a ha. Okay. No, you just hoed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> so I read this book years and years and years ago because Nikki and I have only actually known each other for about four, five, six years. Five. Tyler is six now. And he was and bored. I, you were pregnant with him when I met you. Yeah. But we weren't really friends. No. Though. After he was born is when he helped me. He was like six months. So about five years, we could say fairly. So I read this place seven years ago. Pre and I still remember. Pre. That was B N. Before Nikki. And now we're in the A N. Now we're in the A N. What a beautiful time. <laughs> <laughs> we're in year six. Of five A -N. of A N. I remember the whole story. That rarely happens. Yeah. Because you know, like, we're sitting we here sit and I and, like, can't think remember. Back to it and, stuff. and I not only, like, I remember it so vividly, not only because it was so good, but also because it's so different. I haven't read, and still, I haven't read anything like it ever. That's always nice when you get that, like, <clears throat> nobody yeah. has, like, tried to do this before. Yeah. Scott Westerfield's pretty cool. Like, you know, the afterworlds. Yeah, he always does have a nice. <clears throat> he did the Leviathan. I bought it, but I haven't read it yet. I should. I really like that whole steampunk look of it. So, if you haven't read Scott Westerfield before, or if you haven't read The Uglies, I recommend it. I bet it's super cheap too because they're really old. All of them are out. Oh my god! I just remembered something. He came out with like a fifth one. Did he? And I haven't purchased it yet. Have you read it though? No. I Did just remembered. This? Yeah, I just remembered. What's it called? I don't know. Let us find Give me the one moment and then we'll end this. We'll let you go. We'll let you go. Okay. I wish I could just. I've had about three different songs stuck in my head today, guys, and one of them, surprisingly, is Hilary Duff. That's back in my middle school days. What's she saying? That come clean. And it all started because it was raining this morning. Well, maybe there's not another book. You know the, let the rain fall oh, down and mm. wash it away. <laughs> something, something, my sanity. And I wanna feel the wonder, I want to scream. Oh, also, if you didn't know, we loved karaoke. Maybe it's the imposters. Ooh. I don't know, but look at that. Imposter special edition, four ninety nine. Hello, take my, oh! I need the take my money. Take my money. So now that that's taken care of, I'll check in that. But that's it today. We just did. Decide, we just decided to do four books because yep. you know we've been at work all day. <laughs> Plus these earrings are so fabulous. Oh my gosh, I know. And my makeup, guys. I don't know if you know this, but I have is it concealer? No, highlighter. I have highlight on right now. And Can you lipstick. Guys see it? Do you have lipstick? Yeah, mm -hmm. lipstick. I don't know, my nose does look kind of shiny, so... That's the point. I don't really want my nose to be shiny because I don't like my nose. It's kind of big. I got over the big nose thing a long time ago and just embraced it. I don't know why we're it. highlighting it. Hello! Hey, look at this. <laughs> okay, poke we're done. It's gonna poke your eye out. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Love you, bye! Bye.